Hey guys, so we were just gonna test out this magically appearing color activity. Whoa! But the kids loved it so much, I ended up grabbing my camera and we were at it for over three hours. This is such a fun, creative playdate activity using supplies you probably already have. This is gonna be awesome. Okay. To get started, you'll need paper towels, sharpies, any kind of thick marker or highlighter, and a bin or bowl for water. And first thing, you're gonna take a paper towel and fold it in half, and then use your Sharpie to draw the visible part of your design on the top layer. Oh, and don't forget to put something underneath, more on that later. And then from the tutorials online, the Sharpie is supposed to bleed through to the next layer, but we found, at least with Aviva brand, that's not the case. It didn't really so up. We just ended up going over it a second time, really slowly, and that worked. Or as Presley later discovered, you can do your design on the bottom layer, fold it over, and then just trace because it will show through. Next, the fun part, you add color underneath. Tess went with the rainbow. Ford was cooking up a uh, robot attack. It's gonna be invading a castle. And Presley was creating a work of art. Yours is a masterpiece. Thank you. We found that the thick markers work best as the fine-tipped ones can rip the paper towel. I'm almost done, I'm almost done. I'm done. And it's time for the reveal. Are you ready? Yes. Okay. You just drop it into the water. Ooh. Go for it. <gasps> Look at the color. And it is so satisfying. Whoa. Whoa. And they immediately wanted to do another round. I want to do another one. I'm going to do a snowman. And what I love about this is that you can get so creative, not just with color, but with objects that appear. Oh, I have a great idea. Ford did a little boy pointing at a a ghost that appears. Yes! Whoa! Or in Presley's case, a message she wanted to share with you. Drum roll. I got braces! Yay! I think they're so cute. And speaking of how great are missing front teeth. So as I mentioned, we did this for a long time. Tessie, that is so good. It's just the ordinary run. I don't know. That's oh. on fire. Uh, we also tested a bit, and even though we had read you need to use washable markers, it kind of looked the same regardless. And you can also do highlighters for a really fun neon design. Looks like a watercolor painting. And I thought we'd just be tossing these, but the kids really wanted to save them. And to be honest, when they dried, they look really pretty, maybe for a summer collage or something. Oh, and... No shocker, we still got Sharpie all over the table, but I found that if you take a really wet magic eraser, go over it once, and then the key is to let it soak for a few minutes, the second wipe did the trick for us. All right guys, don't forget to like and subscribe for more fun summer activities. Thank you so much for watching, I'll see you soon. Bye. You guys are so concentrated. <laughs>